Interest rates are down. What does that mean? Hi, I'm Riley. I'm the designated broker of Dwell, a real estate brokerage designed for the consumer. And today, we're gonna get back into market updates. I'm excited about it. We're gonna provide these once a month at the beginning of the month usually, and just basically go over a snapshot of what the market is doing, uh, what are we seeing, the leading indicators, those types of things, um, and really our personal experience as well. Let's start with active listings. Right now we're seeing active listings go up. Uh, right now we're at 18,430 active listings. As of last year this time, we are up 54% from 11,969. Um, and we're up 5.5% from last month of 17,474. Um, for under contract and, and pending listings, we're going down. Uh, so as of last year, we were at 7,111. Right now we're at 6,658 um, or you know homes that are under contract. And uh, that's down 8.6% from last month of 7,287. As far as uh, you know, monthly sales, how many sales we're seeing per month, that's also going down. Uh, we're down 9.3% from last year, and we're down 8.5% just from last month. So 6,208 last month, right now we're at 5,683 um, monthly sales. So what does that do to home prices, right? Everyone's interested in affordability when it comes to homes. What does that do for home prices? Well, right now what we're seeing is home prices are stabilizing. Uh, they're actually up 1.1% from this time last year of the monthly median sales price. So that was 435,000 uh, a monthly median sales price of last year, and now we're at 440,000. So that's up 1.1%. Um, and then month over month, we're not seeing a change. And really, what what does all this mean? It really just means that um, you know, not only buyers are being priced out of the market, but also sellers are being priced out. Uh, you know, sellers have a great interest rate, you know, maybe they refied, they bought at the right time or even on the way up with interest rates and they have a monthly mortgage payment that is affordable to them. Um, you know, maybe 1500 bucks, maybe $2,000. And if they're going to sell and need to get into the bigger house or the next house or whatever it is, they don't want to double their mortgage payment. So people are making do with what they have. Um, and that is just a, a trend. Um, we are seeing interest rates going down though, which is a good thing because inflation is seemingly tamed according to the Federal Reserve. They're gonna meet in September this month and um, effectively announce the cut that they're making to the federal funds rate. And that will affect interest rates for home buyers. Um, a lot of that is priced in the market already, but that's very complex. It's just the economy pricing things in. So. Um, what, what that means is, uh, you know, interest rates aren't going to just drop overnight. You know, you hear a cut and you're like, okay, it, it, homes are affordable again. That's not what it means. What it means is, um, you know, homes are, are going to be on the track of becoming more affordable instead of just, you know, having prices stay high and interest rates stay high. You know, we'll, we'll start to see slow and methodical cuts depending on what the economy does. The Federal uh, Reserve wants to make sure that our economy in the U.S. is strong. With that being said, if we have a major recession and jobs are going down and unemployment is going up, then you know we'll see a more um, you know a more uh, heavy hand when it comes to the Federal Reserve and cutting in those interest rates. So that's just kind of what we're seeing in the market right now. Um, one place in the market that we're that uh, you know isn't on the MLS, so we don't have a ton of data on it, is new build communities. And so these new build communities are great and are uh, having a lot of activity because they have the ability to have in-house financing, meaning they can buy down that rate to, to a much more affordable level for the buyers. So um, I'm seeing rates get sent to me via email um, you know, as low as 4.25% right now. And, and so that's a much more affordable rate than, you know, where we're at really typically at like 6.25%, depending on your credit and everything. So um, these new build communities are still uh, going up. There's ones in Gilbert, as close as Gilbert, um, but a lot of them are on the outskirts of the, the major met metropolitan area. So, um, you know, Santan Valley, we got some in Queen Creek. Um, Eastmark is still, uh, you know, not maybe not it's uh, specifically Eastmark, but um, 
Cadence and, and near the East Mark area. There's a lot of new builds still uh, being completed in there and selling homes. And then one that's that's actually a lot uh, gaining a lot of traction and popularity is Apache Junction. So uh, Apache Junction has you know this great big you know community going up, Blossom Rock. It's it's amazing. Lots of builders in there. Pulte, Tri Point, um, you know KB. All all the major builders are in there, and they're they're you know giving great rates on on um, incentives for buyers to to purchase. So we're seeing a lot of activity there. Uh, if you're comfortable with being a little bit further out and you're okay with the drive, you can get into a home in a much more affordable way than a typical resale and maybe the perfect area that you want to be. But that's real estate, location, location, location. So uh, that's really all that we have going on right now. The market seems to be cooling a bit, but uh, other than you know the cooling, you know we're we're seeing prices kind of remain s stable, and that's just because you know uh, not only buyers are being compressed, but so are sellers. So number of listings sold is going down. We're just seeing a compression of that rather than a compression of prices or anything like that. So that's what we're seeing. Uh, we'll come back at you in the month of October uh, to show you what we're seeing month over month there. Um, but as of right now, that's what we have. Uh, we appreciate you, you watching. Uh, if you have any questions, feel free to reach out. You, you, know, you want an updated uh, market analysis on your home, we can help with that. Um, but we are Dwell, a real estate brokerage designed for the consumer. And what we do is we uh, make it more affordable with people to buy and sell while providing a very transparent and easy transaction. We'll see you next time. Thanks.